Okay, let's deal about the volume of a cube. In the earlier video, what is the cube? Let me just draw one cube. In a cube, what happens is that there are one, two, three, four, five, six faces, okay? And the property of a cube is that all these six faces are equal. So it's, I mean, it's a cuboid only. The only special property is that in a cube, the length of the cube is equal to its breadth is equal to its height. Why? Because every face of a cube is nothing but a square. And in square we know what all sides are equal. Right? Now, in the one of the previous videos I had told you that volume of a cuboid is equal to its length into breadth into height. Right? Now, cube is what? Cube is nothing but a kind of a cuboid. The only difference is that in that case, the length is equal to breadth is equal to height. So can I write this as L into breadth? Breadth is equal to length. Again, L into height. <laughs> height is what? It's again equal to the length or L cube. So the volume of a cube is equal to L cube. Right? So suppose you are given a question and you are told that length of a cube is equal to 8 centimeter. Find its volume. I guess this is easy. All right. Okay, let's see. Length of a cube three times. 8 centimeter cube. So centimeter will come out as centimeter cube. This I told you that volume is always expressed as a measure of cube. And 8 into 8 into 8. Or 64 into 8. 8 times 4 gives me what? 32. 3 carry. 8, 6 is a 48 and 3. 512. 512 centimeter cube. So that's how basically you compute the volume of a cube.